I want to share with you right now today's video, three reasons why your digital marketing sucks or it's failing. What are the top three reasons and how can you overcome them? Now, after having spoken with hundreds of different businesses, these are the three reasons that cost them the most amount of money and also time that they produce zero to minimal ROI and they don't know why. That's what I want to share with you. These are the three main reasons and there are things that you might not even expect that cause your digital marketing to fail and how you can prevent and overcome them. So you can make sure that when you're implementing any digital marketing before you spend that one dime or that cent, you're actually gonna be able to grow your business. And now I wanna preface this as well that these are the things that really just piss me off when it comes to these three things. These are the most uh, simple things that these businesses, they overlook and they overshadow and it's things that are obvious but they, when they overlook them, it causes them to not have the results they wanna get. So that's why if I'm going through this video, you're gonna see I'm gonna be having a little bit more emotional side to it, but that's one of the main reasons because I'm pissed off that all these people, they don't get these three core fundamental things that they can just tap in and overcome to be able to have a more successful digital marketing strategy for their business. The number one factor why your digital marketing sucks is because you lack focus. One of the biggest reasons that digital marketing campaigns fail, and right now especially, you're overwhelmed with a bunch of information so you think that you want to implement tactic one, two, three, four, you want to do this Facebook ad, this Instagram campaign, this specific traffic accelerator thing. You want to do all these different types of tactics that don't end up being strategies. You don't give enough time to be able to focus on one thing. It's almost like shiny object syndrome. You focus on one thing and you jump into another thing instead of just focusing on that one campaign, one defined process to be able to increase your traffic, increase your leads, and then increase your sales. It's the only three ways to grow a business online. You jump around for multiple different things because the next guru or that person said this, that said that, and you try to do all these different things. Just focus on that one defined process. And one thing I want you to bed this into your mind is that it's never about what you do. It's always about how you do it. You can find at least 100 people, whatever thing that they've done in the specific industry or business, let's say in the fitness space, that are extremely 99 that have failed and one that's been successful. What's, what's the difference? Is it because they're in the fitness industry? Is it because the industry that you're in is tough? You know for a fact that there's at least one person in your industry that's extremely successful. It's about how they got there, not about what they did. It's never what someone does, it's about how you do a specific strategy. So the first thing is don't have shiny object syndrome. Don't jump from one thing to the other, just focus on that one thing that you can do, that defined process, and understand how you build that out. That's the first thing, never jump to one thing, focus on that one thing. One thing to also keep in mind is that digital marketing strategy is not supposed to be some kind of complex, overwhelming amount of thing. You wanna focus on understanding that it's a simple process. One of the biggest misconceptions about digital marketing, even from businesses that are starting out, or businesses that I talk to that are doing 100 plus million in revenue, they think they need some complex, sophisticated strategy to be able to grow their business. The truth is, digital marketing is simple. As long as you have a defined process to get there. There's only three ways, right? The traffic, the leads, and the sales. As long as you understand one strategy for each and you focus on tweaking it, amplifying it, you can build a successful multi-million dollar business online. You just have to have that focus and the defined process. Simple, not complex. One of the biggest reasons why 97% or 95%, depending on what statistic you're looking at, fail, is because they experience the number one issue is cash flow. That means that they don't understand their numbers. They're not able to project their cash flow. They collect the money and they spend it out right away. That means they're not getting the money fast enough before their expenses arise and they're paying them out. It's the same thing in digital marketing. The number one reason why these businesses fail is because they don't understand the numbers. They don't look at the CPA, cost per acquisition per customer. They don't understand the LTV, the AOV, all these fancy terms basically mean the numbers that are vital to your business in order for you to scale with the digital marketing. That's the most important thing is that you want to know your numbers. Whenever I speak to a business owner, 90% of the time, if they're struggling or they're failing, it's because they don't know the numbers or they don't know what they don't know. They don't even know that they should know their CPA, the AOV, the LTV. They have a question mark in their mind on what that number even is. The second thing is that if they do know, then they don't know to the degree that they should have it at. So the most important thing you wanna understand is you wanna know your numbers. And I have a video here talking about the PAS matrix, which is a simplified version of the vital stuff that you need to know in order to have a successful digital marketing campaign or strategy. The PAS matrix is what I created so you don't have to be overwhelmed by tough, complex numbers. It's a very simple, de defined matrix that shows you the core numbers that you need to know in your business to make sure digital marketing is successful. 
So that's why the number second reason why digital marketing sucks is because you don't know your numbers. And you don't know, once you have those numbers, how to convert that into activities that's gonna change your business and change your digital marketing. Because what is the good thing about having numbers if you don't know what they mean to your business? Now that you know the three reasons why your digital marketing sucks or it's failing because you have minimal to zero ROI, it's because of those three things. Make sure that you understand these three things, you rewatch it, you hone in on it, and you have a solution to fix it. Everything that I share with you on my YouTube channel, on my website, is dedicated to solving your digital marketing problems. Reason why most businesses can't grow is because of those three things. They can't get traffic, they can't get leads, and they can't get revenue and sales. As long as you have a defined process for all three of these, you're gonna have a consistently profitable ROI-driven digital marketing strategy. So thanks for watching this. I want you to comment below, let me know what's the insight that you got from this, like this video, and most importantly, subscribe so you get future videos just like this, helping you on your digital marketing in your business, and also personally as well as an entrepreneur to entrepreneur. So thanks for watching this, and I'll see you in the next one.